I think the biggest concrete change has been our commitment to do Shabbat because it feels like a really accessible point of entry for our family right now. And so now, whereas we were lighting the candles a lot of Fridays, now we do it pretty much every Friday. I grew up with a strong Jewish identity and a small Jewish education. I um, went to Hebrew school, like most everyone I know, I did not care for it, but I was committed to being a Jew. We've, my husband and I have always belonged to synagogues, um, but I have more of like a cultural affiliation and didn't really know the teachings or know stuff. And this has just provided like, again, like a, a point of entry to ask questions and to think about, to have a more um, text-based understanding for the values that we have. Um, we made some immediate changes. Certainly my husband um, found himself singing the Shema to our daughter um, every night. And e some evenings, in fact, she sings it to him, um, which is very sweet. Um, you know, we always had a little song that we made up uh, to say goodnight to our kids. And this is sort of um, now the second one that we add to the, the bedtime routine. And then we've started thinking about what are some rituals that we can sort of implement in the future. And it may be a little bit fictitious to frame it this way, but we've started to talk about what are some things that we can do on a recurring basis that we don't do right now. And some of them are gonna evolve naturally and some of them are gonna be more structured and developed. Yeah, well, one example for us specifically was that because of the class, we started celebrating Shabbat every Friday, um, which was unexpected. Um, we weren't sure what we were gonna take away from it, but that's been a big takeaway for us in how we incorporate um, that ritual and how important that's become and how helpful that's become for all of us in growing together um, and um, slowing down and eliminating the modern day uh, screen times for the night, um, expressing gratitude. It just turned into this wonderful time that we, we really look forward to each, each Friday. I think what I really enjoyed about it was that we're forming our own Jewish identity as a family. And that's ultimately what it comes down to for us, is that our home has been a place where we, uh, we practice gratitude and we practice safety and we practice, uh, we encourage confidence. Now it's a place that we can still do all of those things, have gratitude and practice confidence and instill positive energies, but there's a Jewish link to it. 